hide in here. But don't worry. It's gonna be okay. for them to go, and then we're gonna find you some dinner. Hopefully find us some dinner. Keep that thing pointed at me if it makes you feel better, but if you shoot me, you'll have to deal with all of them. Pretty big group of them out there. But it'll pass. Eventually. Stop talking, do what I say, and you might survive this. Yes, ma'am. I'd say we make a pretty good team. The two of us. Well, the three of us, I mean. Thanks, I guess. No problem, kiddo. Anytime you need an oversized doorstop, you know who to call. He's a cute kid. You guys living here? You seem kind of young to be a mom. What are you, 13? His real parents are gone. I'm all he has. Then he's cute and lucky. He has someone looking after him. Not much of that anymore. We were out there scouting. Nothing out of the ordinary, and then... Ordinary, and then... Chaos, and... Shit. Those bastards are slow, but God damn it, when there's enough of them. I got separated from the others. God. I hope they all made it. Thought we were ready for anything. What were you scouting for? Gas? Water? Any supplies we could find, really. Sure as hell wasn't worth it. My people are probably at the rendezvous by now. What's left of them, at least. By the way, I'm Ava. And my group? We call ourselves the New Frontier. He's hungry. Hey, why don't you come with me? my people. We have food, blankets, bottled water. Come on, dinner's on me. Groups aren't really my thing. No woman is an island. Have it your way. But you did me a solid here. I won't forget it next time we cross paths. There is no next time. We'll see. The world does work in mysterious ways. These tunnels were abandoned decades ago. But I've heard you can get through. Here's hoping. Javi, I need to talk to you. About? Look, I appreciate you keeping quiet about me and the New Frontier. But what I told you earlier, it's not the whole truth. Their prisoner. I was. I was one of them. I 
should have told you sooner. I... I really should have. Oh my god! You let them brand you? Just listen. I'm not asking you to forgive me. But you have to understand, I had nobody. I was all alone, and I thought I didn't need them. But they were very persuasive. a mistake, and so was not telling you about it. Tell me you're not still one of them. No way. Believe me. I just had to explain, because if they're really in control in Richmond, I can't let them see me. I just can't. So when we reach the other side of this tunnel, I'm leaving. Y'all planning on joining us? Shh! You all hear that? Coming from over there. Can you see anything? <laughs> They're everywhere! Fuck! They are. Keep sharp. Watch out! <laughs> He's gonna be heading this way. Come on, follow me. What the fuck? No one ever mentioned a train in the way. Better find a way around it. We're fucking dead. Maybe we can just go through. Well, does it open? I got it. Come on. Daylight's ahead. Thank fucking God. Let's go. I can't have those walkers following us. Javi and I will block the door. You guys go ahead and make sure it's clear. Make it fast. We'll be right ahead up. I'm staying here. Hold the door shut until I can find something to barricade it with. Hurry! Oh my God. There's so many... Ah, uh, shit! I'm gonna have to break this thing off. Hurry. They're almost here. Javi! I can't... There's too many! Help! Watch that through! Now! Okay, let's go. We gotta... I wouldn't touch that gun, girl. You either, cowboy. What the hell are you doing? I heard you two. You think I'm stupid? Finish your little story. Now. We... We need to keep moving. Nope. You need to talk. Put the gun down, Conrad. Not until she rolls up her sleeve. <laughs> what? Why? I fucking knew it. You're one of them? You're goddamn right she is. What other bullshit did you shove down our throats, huh? She has a right to her secrets like you have a right to yours. Secrets isn't the point. You're missing the bigger picture, son. Don't you see? We bring her to Richmond. They'll give us whatever we want. Medical help for Kate. She's our bargaining chip. They won't bargain with you. You don't know them. Won't know until we try. She's not a bargaining chip. She's a friend. Oh, I'm sure after less than a day, you two are just soulmates. Not a chance in hell. Seriously? It's our best option, and you know it. Hell, it's our only option. Go to hell, Conrad. I'm not doing this. If you want to shoot me, Shoot me. How about I shoot your little boyfriend here instead? What the fuck, Conrad? Then don't let her walk this through that door. Crazy. Shoot Nobody it. has to shoot anybody. Just tell Clem this is how it's gotta be. And then we all step into the sunshine. Come on, man, be reasonable. This helps both of us. Holy shit. 
Oh my, oh my god. Oh my. You two should go. What about you? I'll find my own way. He's dead. Oh, God, it just happened so fast. I'm sorry this had to happen. I really am. Let's go. Where's Conrad? Did he not make it out? He lost it in the tunnel. Attacked us. What do you mean? What happened? He and Clem started arguing. And then... Shit just went south. We had to... Leave him behind. <sighs> Shit! Fuck! Try to stay quiet. <sighs> Jesus fucking Christ. Damn it, Conrad. And the girl, where is she? Or should we assume the worst? She ran off. I just don't know what the hell is going on anymore. God, what a shit show. This isn't what any of us wanted. But right now, we need to find Kate and Eleanor. You're right. I just wish... The gates are this way. If your people are here, that's where they would have ended up. Why is it so quiet? Thought there'd be New Frontier marching in the streets and shit. Practicing on walkers or... Whatever the fuck they do. It does seem strangely quiet. Maybe we just got lucky. Javi, what are they doing? That's their car! Hey, keep it down. Kate? Kate, can you hear me? Kate, talk to me. Say something. Javi? Yes? I could really use something to take the edge off right about now. Huh. Very funny. I've been saving it for a while. Kate! Are you... Are you okay? Come here. Where's Eleanor? She... She went ahead to get help. She hasn't come back. Damn it. They must have got her. Jesus, how far is it to their compound? Not too much farther now. A couple blocks at most. Gabe, help me lift her up. <laughs> I'm thinking Kate's not going to make it much longer. So it's time we walk up to their front door and say hello. All right, fine. Here we go. There it is. New Richmond. We're here, Kate. I'm gonna get you inside, okay? Javi? can save me. How about you and me finally take that trip to Norway? The Northern Lights. Remember? As long as we make some time to hit the slopes, I'm in. Jesus, there's a solid possibility this isn't gonna go our way. If you want to stay behind, 
I wouldn't blame you. Hey, this is where I was going in the first place. Hey! You again? You must have some kind of death wish. She needs medical help. And you have one of our people. Uh-huh. What's your point? After what you did to our people? I know we've both got a bone to pick here, but we can hash that out later. She needs to get to the hospital or she's gonna die. Then I guess she's gonna die. It was your men that shot her. Your bullets. You owe it to us to help now. We don't owe you shit. It's got nothing to do with me. Your people, your problems. She dies? I'm holding you personally responsible. Just cause you say something doesn't make it so. Please, Kate's dying. She needs help. It's not like I don't have a heart, okay? But your people started this whole fucking thing in the first place. Let's not forget what you did at Prescott. What you did to our home. Prescott, right. That whole situation was a damn mess. <sighs> it happened. It's over. My niece is dead. You know you owe us this. Now all of you, lower your weapons. Might be a good idea to play along here, at least for now. You put him down, I'll see that as an expression of good faith. Nice and easy. Everybody, put him down. Trip, please. You're the boss. Yeah, okay. Hands behind your heads, all of you. We let him do this, it's over. We can't give him another inch. For Kate, okay? Now, get on your knees. If he was gonna kill us, I think he'd have done it by now. Do you hear me? I said knees. Guess you were serious about this after all. What the hell's going on out here? They said they weren't here to hurt anybody, so I was trying to see if they... Oh my god. Dad? Previously on The Walking Dead. You don't have to fill his cup up anymore, baby. Grandpa is sleeping. No, Yaya. People's awake. <gasps> Solamente está confundido. Mama. Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> Put your hands up. Close your eyes. Thanks. Mari! Oh! Shit! Kate! Javi, don't! Hey. What do we call you? Sorry, forgot to introduce myself. It's Paul, but my friends call me Jesus. 
I fucking knew it. You're one of them? You're goddamn right she is. If you want to shoot me, shoot me. How about I shoot your little boyfriend here instead? Holy shit! What the hell's going on out here? Oh my god. We're just gonna get that propane, and then come right back. I, I saw it in that pickup truck, parked down the road a little. In front of the Wallace's house. I just wish there was an easier way to get it. And that we didn't have to risk life and limb. Nothing's easy anymore, Kate. But that doesn't mean we don't have to try. <sighs> I know. It's just hard to get used to, that's all. We get over there, we grab the tank, and we get the hell back home. If we're lucky, we won't see a single one of those things. <sighs> Fingers crossed. Let's take it and go. <clears throat> Empty. You've got to be fucking kidding me! God damn it! <sighs> of course it's empty. Why would we get that lucky? Hey, 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 don't beat yourself up about it. It was worth a shot. It just... Didn't work out. I'm sorry. I'm just sick of this shit. I just thought this one time we deserve to catch a fucking break. friends. True. He was so sweet. He always had a smile on his face. That's not true anymore. I know it, it still looks like him, but the kid you knew, he's gone. All that's left is this thing. I don't even know what to call them. If they're not people, if they're just the dead, Muertos. That's what we'll call them. I thought we were gonna die. I thought Gabe and Mariana were just gonna wake up and we would just be gone. I'm right here, okay? I'm here. You're here. We're still alive. That's what matters. <sighs> Can we go back now? I know we all wanted to stay here in the house and wait for David to come back, but it's been three months since he drove away with your mom. What are you saying? We're not safe here. Not anymore. You and I could have been killed out there for an empty can. So, we'll leave. Go somewhere else. Somewhere safer. Somewhere with crazy thick walls, okay? 
and a gate that's 20 feet tall. You really think the kids are going to be happy with this plan? The kids will understand. A and if they don't, we'll just make them see it our way. We have to go. How come? What if I don't want to leave? Cape. We're safe inside the house. We're tired of being afraid. Every time we leave you guys alone. And it's just getting worse out there. Better to leave now. While we still can. But what about Dad? What's he gonna think if he shows up and we, we just ditched him? Your dad would want us to do this game. He'd want us to survive. We've been surviving. Here. At home. Barely. I'm sorry, Gabe. But... Javi's right. Uh, how about... You guys go and I stay here. You're a kid. That's not how it works. I can take care of myself. If I need any help, I'll just ask my friends. Gabe, honey. What? What's, what's wrong with her? Why is she acting so weird? She's sad. Because when we were out, we saw your friend, Drew. But it wasn't exactly him anymore. You mean, he, he was one of them? We're so sorry, Gabe. So you understand why, don't you? Why we have to leave? If that happened to you, I couldn't bear it. When do we have to go? Tomorrow, as soon as it's daylight. I want to leave him a note. I'll help you get started. Okay? What are we going to tell him? I want to say something good. Tell him we'll find him. Somehow, we're all going to see each other again. I like that. I'm gonna write it right now, so we don't forget. Of course. I'll help him. Thank you. Really. Dad? Javi! Is that really you? <laughs> I always hoped I'd find you. God, you have no idea how good it is to see your face. I think I got a pretty decent idea, actually. I knew you were still alive. I knew it! Hey, weapons down! 
This is my family! You gotta let us in. Kate doesn't have much longer. Jesus. Kate! David? I'm here, honey. I'm right here. What the hell happened? She's been shot. And we got the bullet out, but she's still bleeding. We need your doctor. Now, David. What the fuck is she on the ground for? She's barely got a pulse. She's cold as fucking ice. He said we had to kneel. I couldn't hold on to her. The fuck you trying to prove, Max? They're outsiders, David. It's what we do with everybody. She's coming inside. But she hasn't been checked. Fuck that. This is my wife. I... I didn't know. Honest. She's going to the hospital. Now. Our doctor's gonna help you, honey. I'm gonna make sure of it. Wait, I I'm going with you. Sorry, but the rest of you have to go straight to quarantine. What for? All newcomers get checked for bites, and they all have to answer a couple of questions. Our doctor will clear the two of them, but the rest of you have to come with me to the quarantine holding area. If Kate's going to the hospital, then so am I. Not yet. First, you go through quarantine, then we'll see. God, this is bullshit. Come on. I'll be there as soon as I can. Let's go. Trip. Oh, God, Eleanor. When we found the car without you in it, I didn't know what to think. The engine up and died. I came here looking for help, and this happened. I've been so worried about Kate. I told them she needed a doctor. They promised me someone would look into it. They definitely didn't look for her, because she was still in the car. But that's crazy! I told them she was dying. And clearly it wasn't a priority. Well, at least those assholes realized she needed a hospital once they saw her. I'm sorry, Javi. Really, but I didn't have any reason not to believe them. What? The people here in Richmond. Their new frontier. Oh my god. Ho oh, ho ho, you ain't even heard the worst part yet. One of them's his brother. I didn't even know you had a brother, Javi. Hey. Nobody's more surprised than me. I, I thought the guy was dead. We haven't seen David in years. It's just been me, Kate, and the kids this whole time. I don't even want to think about what the odds are, but he did seem pretty damn surprised to see you. Whoever this guy is, he can't be all bad, right? I mean, he helped Kate instead of hauling her down here. Of course he brought her inside. She's his damn wife. You're kidding. Kate is married to your brother? The only reason I know Kate is because she married David. I was the best man at their wedding. Wow. Okay. Family drama aside, hope you know I'm not about to make nice with New Frontier. I know you didn't have much stake in Prescott, Javi, but they burned that place to the ground for no fucking reason. After everything you folks told me, I'm guessing I'm not gonna find my people alive. Hell, Javi. They killed your niece! Shot Kate! For all we know, your brother could have been behind it. And even if it wasn't his idea in the first place... I hate to admit it, but... There's a chance he gave the order. If he didn't know it was them, if he was just trying to get payback for what was stolen... It... It's possible. What was he like when you knew? You guys get along? He seemed happy enough to see you up there. Things between me and him were complicated. Some days we'd be at each other's throats. Other days we could shoot the shit for hours and still find stuff to talk about. So he's a moody son of a bitch, huh? If your brother knew anything about what happened in Prescott, he's got to answer for it. They all do. I owe that to Conrad. I'm not just gonna let things slide. I've never really been an eye for eye kind of man. But people died. We need to even out the scales. 
We need to look like we're playing along with their rules. Go along with what they say. For now. Then, when the time is right, that's when we demand justice. Hey. Hey. I would have been here sooner, but I had to take care of... something. Come on already, Kate's asking for you. Maybe you think it's okay to keep a lady waiting. What about the rest of my friends? They're not invited. Hurry up now. Looks like the rules don't apply to everyone, huh? That's right. Some people get out of here early. Others stay a long fucking time. Trip, just drop it, okay? Smart cookie, this one. Javi, just go. I'll put in a good word for you, okay? See if we can't hurry the process along a bit. Thanks. along with them for now? That doesn't sound good. We have a process. Our own way of doing things. Your guys better not have a problem with that. Things don't go well for troublemakers here. David, you threw us in a cell. Don't expect us to smile about it. We do that to protect our people. It's not personal. You sure about that? Come on. Where are we going? Kate asked for you. I thought you'd want to check on her. Listen, Javi, Gabe... He told me some pretty messed up things. Things I need your help wrapping my head around. He shouldn't have done that. I wanted to tell you myself. Bad news is bad news. Who cares who delivers it? He told me you lost Mariana. Just a few days ago. Oh. I'm sorry, David. She's... She's gone. It's strange grieving for the same person twice. Like losing something you didn't know you had. What was she like, Javi? She was so little when we got separated. We got along well. Her smile kept me going through a lot of rough times. That... must have been nice. How... How did she die? Tell me how it happened. She was just standing there, minding her own business. She just found her lost headphones in the dirt. She was smiling. And then someone put a bullet in her head. What kind of animal would just open fire on her like that? An animal with your mark. My people aren't in the habit of killing little girls. David, I was there. They shot Kate, too. Ask your buddy at the gate if you don't believe me. Max was a part of this? Fuck. I need details. What the hell went down out there? I need to know exactly what happened. Same assholes killed a hostage at this town, Prescott. Prescott? At the airstrip? Their leader flooded it with walkers and, and tear gas. Leader? A crazy bald guy with a beard. Badger, what the fuck have you done now? I'm gonna handle that stupid son of a bitch, okay? Do me a favor, keep this to yourself. The politics here, they can get messy. I thought you were the boss. There's four of us that run, Richmond. You need to impress the other three. Or you'll be back on the road by morning. Try not to stir things up. Fuck that. They'll have to drag me out, feet first. Cut that shit out. 
Well, that'll be exactly what happens. I run security here, but it's not like my word is law. This shit with Badger doesn't make things any easier. Who's the fresh meat? Ava is my brother, Javi. The baseball brother? <laughs> no shit. What are the chances of you turning up on the doorstep? Uh, baseball's long gone. Just regular old survivor brother now. <laughs> From what I hear, there's nothing regular about you. Ava's my right hand. If there's anyone you can trust in Richmond, it's her. That woman, the fucking soldier. She was the first person I met up with after you and me got separated. I never would have made it without her. Gabe said you went back to the house at the start. I'm sorry I never found you. It doesn't matter now. We found each other in the end. It matters to me. Mama and I got routed out of the city on the way to the hospital. It wasn't long before she... Poor Mama. I couldn't get back into Baltimore, so I hooked up with my old unit. We thought we could build a safe zone outside D.C. After what happened to Mama and everyone else, I thought you were all dead. But you were taking care of them. Weren't you? Somehow you found a way. We took care of each other. And we all had each other's backs. You've changed, brother. It took the end of the world. But you finally grew up. This is where they're treating Kate. Don't get comfortable. We're not staying long. Hey, kid. Got everything you need? Uh, yeah. This place is like a resort. Check it out, Javi. Noodles in a cup. We need to get you some real food. Stat. Turn you into a soldier. <laughs> Javi. I'm glad you're okay. <laughs> get off me! I was gonna say the same about you. It's good to have you back. Look at this family. Look at my wife. Isn't she the most beautiful woman alive? Come on. With the lights off, you could mistake me for a walker. I'm pretty sure you have to say that. Doesn't make it not true. Uh, what, you okay? Uh, my... oh, shit. I'll get the doc. I'm fine. I just needed to talk to you, alone. I'm scared, Javi. More than I was the whole time on the road. Even when I thought I was going to die, everything inside me screams to get away from here. These people are killers. And David? Yeah, I know what you mean. This place gives me the creeps. <sighs> I'm glad to hear that. I was afraid you'd been won over by the security here. It's always been you and me on the road, Javi. That's how we've made it this far. Please, promise me we'll go back to that. The first chance we get. This place. It's a cage. I'll find a way, Kate. You have my word. Rest up. You're gonna need your strength. Thanks. I feel better. Knowing we're in this together. But please hurry. I, I don't want to be left alone here. Feeling better? How you doing, sweetheart? David reported some pain. It's less now. Strange how it just comes and goes. I think she pulled her stitches when she sat up. Her stitches? I doubt it. But pain often comes in waves with abdominal wounds. <laughs> I'll give you something to take the edge off, in case it comes back. Truly superlative work. I thought I'd have to operate, but 
All she needed was IV fluids and some antibiotics. How did you find someone with skills like these? A wound like this kills nine out of ten. Whoever did this really knows their stuff. Well, that miracle worker is named Eleanor. She tried to tell you people that Kate needed help. Instead of listening to her, you threw her in quarantine. She's here? We should let her out. I'll vouch for her. Agreed. I'll have Ava bring her here. I want to meet this Eleanor. I'm sure she'll be an asset to our community. You can't just cherry pick who you want. Why don't you let them all out? Can they all perform surgery on a dirt floor with a pair of pliers and no anesthetic? There's your answer. Javi and I have to go meet some people now. See if we can't prove he's worth a damn. We're gonna take real good care of you. Okay? Send my apologies, David. I won't be able to make it. Feeling okay? Fine. I just want to keep an eye on my patient. The others know my vote is with you. Come on. Remember what I said. When we meet these guys, keep what happened to Mariana to yourself. Badger is one of my guys. And I will handle him. It may look pretty, but it's all sugars. There's no substance. It tastes pretty, Clint. That's all that matters. Ah, the brother. Javi, meet the guys. Clint runs food production. The crops you saw, that's him and his people. Jones, our bridge to the outside world. She handles contact with other settlements. Pleased to meet you, Javi. I trust you've been treated well. I hope you haven't been handled too roughly. Some of our people left their courtesy with their old lives. <laughs> no complaints here. I get that you guys have a way of doing things. Thank you. We have to be careful. I'm sure you can understand. <laughs> we were just about to eat. Clint was trying to convince me of the essential superiority of his cream spinach over my magnificent Black Forest Gateau. It's no contest. The spinach has real nutritional value. Javi. Take a look at that table. You tell me what you'd rather put in your belly. Spinach from Clint's garden? <laughs> or a baked delicacy by yours truly? I'd have to go with that cake. I haven't seen anything like that in years. Uh, suit yourself. Come on, Clint. At least he's being honest. Please, make yourself comfortable. We value straight talk here, so please... Forgive me if I seem direct. We're usually pretty strict about who we open our doors to. Your brother's word counts for a lot. Is that so? The three of us and Dr. Lingard make all the decisions here, so yeah. People who choose to stay with us, they have to deal with us bossing them around. Not saying you wouldn't, but it can be an adjustment. Especially for the more independent-minded. There's no structure out there now. People get used to doing as they please. You'll tell the line. He'll answer to me if he doesn't. When Joan and I met your brother, he was trying his hand at fruit. Fruit? We found him slowly murdering an orchard on the Shenandoah River. Hotty fucking ha. Huh? I helped him bring it back to life. We had a good run there. For as long as it lasted. What happened? What always happens. We trusted the wrong damn people. That's what led us to start this. Wondering what this fine piece of body art is all about? It's our litmus test for loyalty. I've seen that mark a few times. You probably saw it at the gates. Right, Javi? We all took it as a sign of commitment. It was a crude answer to a difficult problem, and it hasn't always worked. Please understand. We had a terrible winter just after we moved here. We... we lost a great deal. Loved ones who left holes in our lives. Protecting my people from that kind of pain, that's what keeps me awake at night. It turned me into a perpetual night owl. I know it's a lot to ask. Funny you should say that. 
Some of your people. They keep me awake. In fact, some of them give me nightmares. My people? I'm sorry, Javi. I don't quite follow. Max? What are you doing here? I sent for him. Since when does he answer to you? From what I hear, he's well acquainted with your brother. They exchanged a few bullets outside our walls. Is that right? Is there bad blood between you and Max? Nothing that can't be worked out. Let's just say I wouldn't invite him to my wedding. Yeah, I wouldn't fucking go. Good, because I just said you wouldn't be invited. Max, how did this start? Don't look at him. You have an obligation to tell the truth. We caught him siphoning gas from one of our vehicles. Max. Sorry, David. I know he's family, but your brother's a thief. Is it true? Answer her. I was scavenging whatever I could find. I had no idea it belonged to you. If you just asked, we'd have given it to you. That... that's not all. Rufus said Clementine ran his truck off the road just to break him free. Clementine? A girl we had trouble with in the past. You can always judge a man by the company he keeps. Running with that girl don't look good. What's your problem with Clementine? You got a lot of hate for a teenage girl. We kicked her out for a reason. Now you two are thick as thieves. This is who you're asking us to vouch for, David? Seriously? You know we can't just open our doors to bandits. We're trying to build something different here. Oh, for God's sakes, get off your high horse. Don't pretend like your people don't have blood on their hands. I'm not sure what you mean. We hold our people to the highest standards. Javi? You have something to say? One of your people, some asshole called Badger, he put a bullet in a little girl, my niece, David's daughter. What? Damn it, Javi, I told you I'd handle it. No, David, this cousin fucking dirtbag has the balls to accuse me. He and Badger destroyed an entire town. That's enough. No, we need to hear this. Go on, Javi. They overran Prescott with walkers, ran them in on trucks. Badger did that, not me. You were right there next to him. I tried to get him to stop, I swear. David, we warned you about getting your soldiers in line. We don't know all the facts. We know enough. She's right, David. You've lost control. I want them gone. All of them. Take Javi and everyone in the quarantine to the gate. Send them out with enough weapons to defend themselves, but no more. Look, we can't fight this. Not now. Kate and Gabe will be safe here. Your doctor friend, too. But the rest of you... You're gonna have to do what they say. I'm sorry. Are you fucking kidding me? Just play along, okay? I'll help you when I can. Just stay alive, okay? I don't gouge your fucking eyes out with my thumbs. You hear me, asshole? David packed this. He did. They said- Start walking. What about Eleanor? Walk. Eat shit. Answer my fucking question. God damn it, Harvey! This isn't her fault, Trip. You're mad at the wrong person. Do not fuck this up. There's a settlement a few miles west of here. Don't come back.
Did you piss in someone's oatmeal back there? Thought you were gonna play along. We trusted you. Everything was going okay. At first. I don't know what happened back there. Yeah, well, I got a pretty good idea what's gonna happen out here. Let's just see what they gave us. Knowing them, it's probably a butter knife and a stick of gum. They could have just shot us. More than once. Oh, how fucking neighborly. What's that? It looks like a map. I doubt they give one to everyone. Ava did say David packed the bag. Why the hell is it tied to a baseball bat? David's sense of humor was always poorly timed. Looks like they're expanding. Some of these areas are marked clear. Okay. There's Richmond. That helps. But we can't go back there. Knowing where it is lets us know where we are. Pretty sure David wants us to go there. And if this is us here, then I think we can head along this path. Just gotta head north. And to find north, we need to find the North Star. There. The end of the Little Dipper. No. That's the Big Dipper. That's it. We need to go this way. What else is in there? Not a whole lot. Flashlight. Not enough weapons. No food. Let's go. Trip, come on. What's up? I can't lose anyone else. I'm telling you, I can't. Prescott, Conrad, maybe Eleanor. You won't lose anyone else. I won't let that happen. I'm gonna hold you to that, Hobby. <sighs> Sorry, man. Rough day, to say the least. I know you got my back, and I got yours. Of course. After you.